And with the development of the sticky hooks, you know, like I didn't have to have the stickiest hooks all the time because A, the people in the tournaments were never ready for me to do it because of the speed, intensity, and timing that the, like the diving knee slice would come at. Sure. You know, they never really got an opportunity to defend it. I'm just already in and through. And it wasn't until I trained with uh, Dante Leon, actually, really made me come go back to the drawing board a little bit. The very first <clears> time <throat> I ever rolled with him. Uh, and this was when I was a brown belt. It was right before the Nogi Pans, before uh, I won at 159 and Daisy Fresh and all that came out. I went up to his gym, me and Bird. And, you know, what, he wasn't part of our team. He's just, we've always fucking thought he was awesome. We watched him do what we did, you know, just be another American on the podium when it's all Brazilians. And he's a cool guy. And uh, I had some success knee slicing him, but then there were times I like, I got my underhook. How at the time I was like, yeah, I got this shit, and he would get away. And I was like, all right, why? And I had to go back to the drawing board a little bit and start developing some new concepts to deal with it, and and mentally, uh, 